Oh, he hit it, son. Swim bait, swim bait, swim bait. All designed for bass fishing. I'm very curious if we're gonna be able to take these out into the salt and catch either red specks, whatever it is that we have inside our salt water bay system. Um, I do know that there are Louisiana YouTubers that are able to catch reds and bass in the same waters. I do know also that uh, some of y'all have stated that if I go further inland in some of our bayous and creeks, I will also be able to catch bass, but I've never really done it before. These guys have been sitting there for quite some time because I rarely ever go bass fishing anymore. Y'all love seeing saltwater fishing videos and uh, I'm just very curious if I can use these big swim baits to go out there and catch any of our big three that uh, swim around. So we're gonna grab a big stick to sling these heavy fellas and see if we can get this 10,000 fish head hunter and the bull shad to bring in some guys. But no need to worry because we're also gonna take the shimmer swimmers and maybe the skelly swim some of our other lures so welcome back to the channel y'all today's video is sponsored by catchco all those brands back there are a part of the catchco umbrella and if you're interested in them and you would like to save approximately up to 30 percent off on some of the lures that they have go down below click on that link it's going to take you to the shop carl's website that is a membership style uh site that if you become a member, you can save that 30% off on some of those lures. You're gonna be very surprised to see a lot of the tackle that they have. And uh, that's where I shop for, I'm gonna say approximately 85 to 90% of the tackle that I currently use for the channel. So we're gonna get these guys loaded up and we'll get out there on the water. Something. It's like a red? Yeah. No, it's head shaker. Big trout. Big trout? Yeah. Yes. Good job, sir. Yeah. Yes. Let's Big go, one. baby. Good job. Uh huh. Awesome. First fish, maybe spot liquor here. Because I was catching them all day, yes, the other day here. Let's get this big papa unhooked. Look at that perfect hook set there. Hey. Look at that, just came undone. Stop, dude, you're gonna hook yourself in my lure. You're gonna hook me even worse. That's a nice trout right there. That's a good one. Hold it right there. I mean, do you wanna keep this just in case we don't get a good video and we do a catch cook? That's complete up to you. I'm not gonna cook it. Ah, uh, he's looking at me in my eyes, I can't. You get on going. Awesome, good old, good old way to start the day. Nice fat trout. And you already know what we got it on, guys. No need to change it up. No need to try something crazy. We are going to try something crazy, though, because I want to have some fun. But I always like to check and see if the fish are here. 
and I kind of like to think of this as my control. This is a set variable. This thing catches fish. There's no doubt in my mind about that. So I like to see if there's fish here by using this bad boy because I know they'll bite it. Give this bad boy a go, guys. Now start playing. Play with these lures over here. The rattle bot or whatever they call it. I'm gonna work this like a corky. Spoonbill up ahead. Yeah. Oh, he hit it, son. Definitely not going to get off. Oh, no. It's the Mike Buka. Look how big he is. Oh. Oh, Oh my God! Didn't I tell you? I told you that if we were if we were gonna get hit, it was gonna be a big one. Holy cow! <laughs> the, sw the swim bait crushes it. I don't. Oh goodness gracious! This girl. Holy moly, man! Yes, got her. Yeah. So we can go ahead and put her back in. All right, here we go. We'll see you later, sweetheart. Oh gosh, the thump on that was so, it was so darn awesome. Holy cow. Check this lure out, y'all. I mean, I know y'all saw the B-roll already, but I was just like, I'm gonna work it like a corky. Uh oh, look at this right here. I told myself that I was just gonna work it like a corky and the dude just whacked it on the second cast of doing that. Oh, wow. I'm going to see if we can get another one on it. Wow. <laughs> Holy moly. I don't know if this thing's what they want. Do fish, do trout even attack regular rattle traps? They hit like these big rattles like one or two rattles inside lures yeah but do trout even like that yeah they they will hit that this is like a more of like a, because of the side to side wobble that a rattle trap has i mean like i didn't know if this was going to work or not so let's see if this one will this is a certified boga lure <laughs> All right, as we're talking, let's go, man. This is gonna be a nice guy. Oh yeah, Just trout for sure, pulling too. You know what I think, son? It's like we're using stuff that they don't really get. Oh gosh. Dude, these are all big monsters. Here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Let's go. <laughs> man, these trout are so nice, dude. What the heck? I ain't never seen nothing like it. Holy cow, son. Well, you want to get a photo like this is what you mean? I got to kill that motor. I don't know where your line is going. Oh, uh, yeah, let me... No, I, we already got a photo of the trout unless you want another one. Yeah, sure. All right, hold on. All right, let's re release this big mama trout, man. These guys are nice. Get going, that much. Oh, dang it! Oh, my God, they are in here and... the back so it's pushing all the bait in. They want to crush it. The water moving. Something's after him. See how he's in a defensive posture? Mm -hmm. Maybe he's scared of us. <laughs> no, he's uh, he's like, holy shit, I'm about to get up. He's caught in the current, huh? Yeah, that's what happens. Like, they get caught and baitfish just crush him. 
gonna order another one of those little Mike Luca swim baits. The pool shad. Mm -hmm. This freaking thing was awesome. Just seeing the action that it gave was freaking awesome. I have a fish. Oh man, I have a nice fish. Get the uh oh, it's a little red. I thought that was a really nice trout. Yeah, I know. It's just where he's against the current. We're moving against the current. How are you doing, Mr. Red? Now we just need a flounder. He just picked it up. I didn't even notice him get it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. How did you even bite this? I think he might have just retired the shimmer swimmer, but look at him. <laughs> what a nice little fellow. Little guy. All right, you guys, and after that one, this Shimmer Swimmer is retired. This one honestly should go into the Hall of Fame because I've had it on here for probably over 10 fish. He's still got both eyeballs on. You can see his back is just riddled, and he's still catching fish. I could probably keep using this and still catch fish, but he's done such a good job that I'm going to put this guy on my wall of fame and uh, sign them, maybe give it away someday. Thought I felt something. That's my line. Yeah. I don't think so. That's a big girl. Get the net. It's a keeper for sure. Awesome. Good job. That is four keepers. Mm -hmm. from us. Open up. Man, that is a good solid fish right there, son. Good job. Oh man. Didn't get a good hook set. Yeah, I didn't get a good hook set. I was like trying to do the most. I need to be well, fishing it. Where we were catching them. Spot like us. We're still able to fish though. There we go. Oh no! Again. Yeah, dude, what the hell? That was a good hook set this time. Alright, I'm not playing no more games. This next hook set is gonna bring them out of the water completely. You got him? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Boy, it's like a largemouth bass. Oh. Oh. You got the oh. net over there, so. Oh. Dang, he was darting around. No, you little bag. Come here. Ugh. It's four keepers, son. God, he's fighting everything. This trout. This guy was a champion jump trout jumper there. Jeez, man. Hey, let go of my net. Fights a bass lure, acts like a bass. There we go. Look at you. Let's get him back in the water where he belongs. Just off like a freaking missile too. Jeez. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This lure just is magical. Yeah, it is. This thing, I mean, it hasn't even got a broken tail. His action's <laughs> jacked up and he's still working. <laughs> bit my tail off. I know I felt them. I don't know. I'm so hungry. This lure smells so darn good. I uh, know. I want to try that taco truck. That's all I've been thinking about. Because <laughs> I haven't ate nothing all day. Except for a can of coffee. I got your fish. I got your fish. Stop splashing. <laughs> I'm going to take brain damage. Solid keeper, son. That's, a, that's a limit for you. Yeah. Stop it, buddy. Hey, hey, you're I gonna f me up with your gill plate. That's what I was saying. Stop, bro. I yeah. think he pooped. Yeah, he did. He pooped all over the boat. You sick <laughs> you. This guy, he's got s all on his tail. Look. Nasty. You're nasty. I'm getting you out of here, you sick, you sick trout. Get going. Look at this. 
poop on my socks, poop on the boat. Now you know who has to clean that? <laughs> you, you gotta clean that. Got him. He feels little. Oh gosh, no, it's a keeper. Oh, quick release. Got him right at the boat. Keeper. Nice neck jab. Boy, he came right up to the boat. That's two for me. It would have been three had the other guy not did the quick release on us. Right there. Beautiful speckled trout. Got him! Oh yeah! Oh my God! Look how dark it is. Whew, look at his tail. He, his tail's all gimped out. This dude was just look at that. Somebody got him. Somebody got him out there in that open bay. I guarantee it. And then he comes in here, and we just whack him. Good night. Nothing but keeper trout, son. This guy is like the small end. I doubt, I mean, he's probably 14 going on 15. I'm not going to count him as a keeper. There's a cormorant up there camping at the mouth. <laughs> right at the top of the mouth, too. There we go. Okay, okay, okay. There you go. Get in the water. A little guy? Has to be a tiny. This is the smallest one yet. Well, I mean, he might start. Oh, the juice yeah, he just here. did. No. Oh, that would have been another keeper. They just swim in with the current. Yeah. That's why they feel small. So hard to uh, get a good hook set, too. Yeah. Oh, again, right here by the boat. Nah, so all the small ones are right out here at the mouth. Bro, chill, chill. Like you're flinging my lure all over the place, buddy. Now this is the smallest dude of the day for sure. All right, there you go. Good job. That looks like a big one, son. Holy cow. Oh yeah, another keeper. Oh, I'm not gonna touch it, so you go ahead. There you go, you got him. That's my special maneuver where I trap them against the boat. Six now? Six keepers? Yeah. Uh, maybe. You think that's a keeper? Let me see. Yeah, that is a keeper. Got him. Boy, he thumped that one hard. Think it's a good one? I'm going to need that net. That's okay. That's okay. Yeah, what? Okay, yeah. He's a keeper. Yeah, baby. Dual wielding. Woo, my God. Double up. Dual wielding speckled trouts over here. Get this guy back in the water. Yeah, baby. Here. Nope. <laughs> he heard here. <laughs> Where's he going? Yeah. Boat flipper or a net? No, I'm, I'm going to use a net. He's a keeper. Ah, gosh, that's right down there at like the low end. Okay. I don't know. He's gonna be like right at. The way I like to think of it is, if I got a full-size sub from Subway, if he's just a little, like two or three inches bigger than a Subway sandwich. No. <laughs> if he's there, like he's barely gonna be there. If he's a keeper, I, I'm gonna call him like a 14. That's a. You can get him on the Hungry Man rule. The Hungry Man, yeah. One more cast for good measure. Time on deck is 3.30, and it has just been absolute. Look at that, there was a trout just blow up right there. I would poop my pants if you caught him. But yeah, it's been a an exceptional day. Uh, we just can't draw plans up like this right here. And uh, I'm not gonna pretend 
like I uh, am a pro and I know what I'm doing. We got lucky today and I just count the blessings that we're able to experience something like that together. Wow, absolutely phenomenal. Thanks for watching everyone. If you're interested in any of the lures that we use today to catch those big old speckled trout, then be sure to go to the Shop Carl's website where you can take a look at the Shimmer Swimmer, the Battle Bot right there, the uh, Biospawn Exo Swim, and then the Bull Shad right there. I have super high hopes for that Bull Shad. I'm going to be using it like a Corky. That seemed to trigger the fish, but then I had a uh, backlash with the Corrado DC, and then off my, <laughs> my Bull Shad went. So we got to place another order. Again, go to the Shop Carl's website. If you become a member, you're gonna be able to save up to 30% off on a lot of the tackle that's there. And I just definitely think that you're gonna enjoy that. All right, again, if you enjoyed it, hit that thumbs up button. And until next time, tight lines, y'all.